Hi, I'm Mitch McCarran, and this is my game day. Some breakfast at a place called Little Red Bluff, which is our new, well, that's our new spot, I suppose. Moved out to Slovenia uh, on a three month contract, and that was it. It was a big risk for me um, to go over there, and a lot of people were saying it's not the right decision, or you know, you're not maybe ready for a point guard, especially over in Europe. And I made it work, and you know, we won a championship, so that was a really rewarding feeling. I was sitting in my room in Slovenia in late May, not really knowing what I was doing. And there were a few other leads in places like Italy and Germany. But then Melbourne came to the table, and I don't know whether that had something to do with Casey Prey for not coming back, but Dean reached out and pretty much said, this is why I would like to have you, and this is how I think you can help us. And I was really excited about yeah, joining this club. Why would you? Money making Mitch McCarran, and McCarran keeps it going. PS4, right now I'm playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. If I've got an hour or so before the game, I use it to just chill out and just take your mind off the world, take your mind off basketball and get lost in my little character. Abby and I met in college in Denver. Uh, we were both freshmen, she played soccer, I played basketball. I played soccer. Um, heard he was into soccer girls. No, I'm kidding. Um, <laughs> I have found through the years that not a lot rattles him, um, which is a great thing in his position. My mom just basically calls him Mr. Robot. I feel like game day is any other day, which is great. Harry's worked really hard with his team in building that entertainment side of the NBL. I definitely think the league's in, in a really good spot. Uh, I think it's got even more room to grow, and I think Larry knows there's an opportunity for, for more growth there. Um, there's so much talent out here. People love their basketball, and with the new team coming into Melbourne, I, I think this city's going to, you know, have another little rivalry going on, which will, you know, bring in more fans as well. So I, I think it, it's definitely onwards and upwards for this league. Make your way out. Love you. About a quarter past one, I'm all strapped up, ready to go. Gonna get some shots up, start to feel good, and then we'll do our official team warm up, have our team talk, and then it's game time. Shine it on the back there. No worries. Thanks, mate. Mitch McCarran is with me, Mitch. Uh, it's got that big game feel about it, hasn't it? Yeah, it's gonna be packed house, and Sydney have been playing really good ball lately, so I'm sure they're gonna come in here wanting to steal one on the road. This is what Australian basketball is all about at the moment. The sold out sign on the front door. Two teams loaded with world class talent. Sets it inside. DJ over to Mitch. And McCarran with a slam. Melbourne United can win the game. 82 apiece. Castleware pulls up the three. Just saying. Money, baby. <laughs> <laughs>